Hello everybody, this is Petey from Bergsberg Arcade at BergsbergArcade.com and here we are with tutorial 275, I believe. And this one here, I actually just want to go ahead and if we actually look at some of these uh, classes we made, we threw enumerations that we're referencing at the end. And I actually want to fix that. Now I know we, at least I thought we had more than the ones that I was just looking at. We have one here in the vital script. We'll go ahead, we'll open that up. And it's not much, it's just this enumeration here. We had uh, one in the attribute script right here. And we'll see what else we have in it. Uh, skills, we have it in skills. You can see it right here. We'll open that up as well. And I thought I had more. I'm pretty sure I do. I think it's actually down in items. Yeah, here we go. But anyway, what I'm going to do. I won't do them all on camera because it's actually just the same thing over and over and over again. But I'll show you how I'm going to do it. And I'll use the ones that we're using for the character as an example. So we'll go ahead, open up the base classes. Let's just start with the attribute. We're going to open it up. I'm just going to take a look at the name here, attribute name. I'll even cut or copy and paste it. I'm going to come in, create a new class, uh, C Sharp. I'm going to go ahead and copy that name in. Now this is actually going to go ahead and create a new script for us with that name. And we open it up and there's a class in here. Well, we don't need any of this. So what we'll do is we'll come in here and we're just going to cut this out. And save it off. Make sure you don't cut up too high and you end up taking out this last bracket. And I'll come in here. And I'm just going to paste over everything. There we go. And I'm going to want to clean this up. I like to prefix, prefix the beginning of everything with a little bit of info. So usually it's a tribute. Uh, I can spell today. Tributing.cs, the date, which is September. No, oh, sorry, September. I'm a month behind. October 29th, 2012. All right, and then just a quick description. Now this is a list of all the troops that we will have in game for our characters and mobs and NPCs, um, just everything in general. Great, that one's done. I will come out. There should be no errors. You'll originally get an error if you pause the video and go back. It's going to say that uh, the tribute name was already used, and that's because when we created this script, it did create a class for us, and we had a conflict of name because the class was called the tribute name, and so is our enumeration. But once we get rid of that class and just paste the enumeration in there, uh, everything's fine. So let's go ahead and we'll do the next one, uh, vitals. So vital name is what I called it. I'll come in here, create a new C Sharp script, vital name. I'll go ahead and save it. See, I get the error here, stating that uh, we already have a definition for vital name, which is perfectly fine. We'll go ahead and we'll open it up. I've got a tribute done and I've got a tribute name done, so I'm going to shrink those down. I'll just get rid of them. And I'll come in, just like before, cut it, save it, close it, come into vital name, copy over everything, save it. And I'm going to go ahead and put the information up here again. Uh, it's just me senselessly typing. I'm, I've already shown you what, so you should be okay there. And we also have skill. So I'll go ahead and do skill as well. So skill name. So I'll come in, base character. Uh, create new C Sharp script. Skill name. Now you can even actually even change this if you want it to be a little bit more explicit of what it is. Maybe call it skill name enum or something like that. Uh, it really doesn't matter what you name the script. Uh, whatever helps you. I'm just going to keep it the exact same as the numeration name, at least for now. That way I don't go ahead and create a class that has the same as same name as my enumeration. Now I already forget what the other one I think it was this one here. Yeah. So 
So I'm going to keep those open because I do know I have to go through and add some text to it. Maybe you just might want to come in and make a folder here and just say nums and go ahead and actually copy those in. That's perfectly fine too. Now I'm actually going to lose it over here. That's fine. Let's go ahead because it moved. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead. Whoops. Uh, I'm not sure exactly what happened there, but this was vital name. I believe. And capital. But like I said, it really doesn't matter what the name is because it's not a class. We don't have to worry about it. And I also need, I'm not sure why it keeps making nums. Uh, if you look here, it just says vital name. Okay, skill name as well. So we do have vital name, skill name. Is nums back? Nums is gone. Okay, so I'm gonna close that. And I'm gonna go keep going through uh, my scripts and take out all those enumerations that we made. I don't think we have any for here. You'll be surprised that you might actually come across a few enumerations that we can share between scripts. I don't think we've actually gotten that far in yet. Uh, let's see. Well, like I said, I know we do have some for items. So I'm gonna go ahead and do these as well, not for armor level. Uh, but anyway, uh, that's what we're going to be doing. Go ahead and pull those out, put them into separate files, clean them up. I'm going to go ahead and create folders for them as well, called the nums, although you don't really need to. Uh, but whatever suits your needs and helps you organize, uh, this is a short video. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.